had a request for a little different camera angle on Strum 7, um, which on uh, in Jason's ukulele book is on page 17, but you might have one of our other handouts. Um, Strum 7 used to be uh, in... Anyway, we've renumbered the strums, so here's Strum 7 from that angle. I'll show it to you from this angle first, so that would be... Down, ka-chinga, down, ka-ching, put it down, ka-chinga, down, ka-ching. So now here's the different angle. Try to get my chord hand out of the way. This is bad technique on a left hand, but I'm just going to to get it out of the way. So it's one. These are regular strums. Here's the technique. Like that. is this eventually you'll get to um, I think it's strum 14 I need to double check that before I let's go setting it off on a wild goose chase yeah strum 14 we have a triple up strum where you're going to combine those two techniques so you get mostly you see that in um in fast hula sometimes where you don't want to go um triple up strum but that's just one of those and then you kind of combine it with one of those and you do it all together boom 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 a little awkward doing it off at that angle but anyway sounds like that but if you don't want to do the triples and you just want to do the um the doubles that's a good way to practice it from the front view. It looks like that. Or the side view. So you would use this a lot in hula vamp kind of scenarios. flicker da -da -doo, da -da -doo. or giddy up sometimes we call it giddy up hard to do it in slow-mo hopefully that gives you enough angle on to see what's going on at, at tempo it'll sound like Anyway, hope that helps. Aloha.